Good morning. We will pay attention to the income statement today. The trial balance is given on the 30th of June 2016. All the accounts in the balance sheet section will only be used when we complete the balance sheet or the notes that will accompany the balance sheet. The nominal account section will be used to complete the income statement because in the income statement we want to show all the income and expenses. At the top of the income statement we will show the trading account section. That means we will take the sales and cost of sales to determine the gross profit. Sales is 60000 The cost of sales must be in brackets because we have to deduct it from the 60000 to give us the gross profit of 20000 So the difference between the sales price and the cost price is the gross profit before any other income and expenses were taken into account. Then we have to look at any other operating income. In this example, we only have commission income. We will transfer the 1,700 commission income and will then indicate that the total operating income is 1,700. We then have to look at all the expenses that was paid in the business. Increase is 14,200, stationary 880, and admin expenses 2,300. In the income statement, we will write down all our operating expenses, salaries as 14,200. Stationary as 880, admin expenses as 2300. Then we will add all these expenses together to get the total operating expenses. If we use the gross profit plus other income, less operating expenses, we will determine the operating profit. So operating profit is the profit that we made on all the operations of the business. After we calculated the operating profit, we will take into account the interest income and interest expense. The interest income is 800 and the interest expense 1,400. We will show the interest in expense and the interest income so that we can determine what is our total profit. The interest income is added to the operating profit, so that will give us 5,120. The interest expense must be deducted because it will reduce the profit and then we determine the net profit for the year as 3,720.